Hi guys, this is Bilal Khan and you are watching Simplified Coding. Welcome to another episode of Android Development Tips. And today I will tell you about one more thing that can make your life easier as an Android developer. So to make things smoother, many of us prefer to debug the apps directly in a real mobile device. And to debug the application, we use a data cable to connect our device directly to our computer. But using a data cable sometimes irritates a lot. So today, I will tell you how you can debug your applications in a real mobile device without using a data cable. So to connect this device to my computer, I will be using a plugin that will wirelessly connect my device to my computer. And we will be using Wi-Fi for this. So let's open the settings in my android studio so here is a blank project basically i just want to open android studio and doesn't matter which project you are using now here in android studio we will go to android studio and then preferences and from the preferences we will open the plugin section inside the plugin section we will go to marketplace and here we will search android wi-fi adb and this is the plugin that we will use. So we need to install this plugin first. Now once you install the plugin, you need to restart the IDE. After installing the plugin, you will see this option here that is Android Wi-Fi ADB. So open this and here you will see the devices that are connected to your computer. So first time you need to connect your device with a data cable. Okay, so only first time you need to connect it with the cable. So once the device is connected, you will see it here and here you can click on this button that is connect. As you can see, our device is connected wirelessly to this computer and now we can simply remove the data cable. And even after removing the data cable, we can debug the applications in this device. So let's see if it works or not. So what I will do is I will just run this sample application this is basically an empty application so let's run it as you can see it is installing and the application ran in my phone as you can see here so this plugin works absolutely fine and it is very handy to debug applications directly in your mobile devices and i use it all the time so that's all for this video friends i hope you found this helpful and learned something new and i hope this plugin will help you to debug your Android applications and it will make you more productive. So thanks for watching everyone. This is Bilal Khan now signing off.